Today's storms are adding urgency to the situation in La Union, New Mexico. That's a community that was hit hard with intense flooding earlier this summer. KFOX 14 News at 5, Selena Madrid live in La Union. She shows us what Doña Ana County is doing to address that situation. Selena. Well, luckily, Robert, it hasn't rained that much here in La Union here today. But if you drive around La Union, what you're going to see is a lot of these sandbags right here in front of people's homes to hopefully help protect their property if more rain were to come in. Now, this street specifically, Centenario Street, experienced significant flooding last month. And it was so bad that you couldn't even see the roadways. Now, to try to help and control the floods in this community from getting as bad as they did last time, the county has now hired a contractor to begin repairs on the dam that breached. More rain in La Union, something people who live in the area have learned to fear, now hoping the dam repairs will work after years of broken promises. The same repairs they did last time, then it's probably not going to do anything if we get the same amount of rain. But if they did some drastic changes as opposed to the first time they tried to fix it, I guess. Doña Ana County hired Smith and Aguita Construction to add permanent repairs to the spillway and the top face of the dam caused by excess water. Smith and Aguita was contracted specifically to help patch and do some repairs on the spillway. And so that would get us to a point that we would be able to withstand uh, another storm. This is their contract that lists the work they've been hired to do, totaling out to nearly $300,000. I reached out to Anita Skipper, the county's chief communications officer, to request an interview. I wanted to find out how the repairs are going to help prevent another catastrophic event in La Union. But the interview was declined. So I went straight to Smith and Aguita Construction, who was going to speak with me. But the morning of the interview canceled because the county said all communication on the project had to go through them. I, I don't believe there's anything to hide. I mean, that's why I'm here speaking with you. That's when I went to Doña Ana County Commissioner Manuel Sanchez. So I can't speak specifically for why they may not have provided that information. I haven't spoken with Ms. Skipper or... Now, while the county waits for the repairs to be complete, in the meantime, they are adding some type of fill material to the structure to help control the release of water coming into the La Union community. I'm reporting live from La Union, New Mexico. Selena Madrid, KFOX 14 News at 5.